For thousands of years, reindeer farming has been an integral part of life for indigenous people in the Yamal Peninsula. The Nanets migrate along the Arctic tundra, herding reindeer on pastures in one of the most remote and harshest places on Earth. In winter, the nomads head south when marshland freezes. These days, though, this annual winter migration is delayed. They now travel much later than normal due to a rapidly warming climate. As in most areas north of the Arctic Circle, this remote region of northwest Siberia is under serious threat from global warming. The vast field of permafrost beneath the tundra is melting rapidly, and the evidence can be seen across the region. The Nenets believe that the lake by their regular camping spot has overflown due to melting of permafrost. Many scientists believe global warming is causing permafrost to thaw, releasing huge amounts of greenhouse gases into the atmosphere, which in turn speeds up global warming. When permafrost melts, huge deposits of organic substances that have been frozen for tens of thousands of years decompose, potentially releasing enormous amounts of methane and carbon dioxide gas. Разложившаяся органика является мощнейшим источником поступления парниковых газов в атмосферу. Так что чем сильнее будет таять мерзлота, тем больше парниковых газов будет поступать в атмосферу. Это совершенно очевидно. Мы можем ошибиться в количественных оценках, но то, что этот процесс имеет глобальный характер, глобальное значение, глобальные масштабы, это совершенно очевидно. According to the UN, methane is 25 times more potent than carbon dioxide over a 100-year period. And Russia, which is 60% covered by permafrost, most likely holds the biggest methane threat in the world. Нужно заключить новое международное соглашение, по которому мы бы гарантировали, что парниковые эмиссии, которые ведут к глобальному изменению климата, были бы снижены, минимизированы. И тогда мы как минимум затормозим те негативные процессы, которые происходят в том числе в российской Арктике. Back on the tundra, the Nanets have more pressing concerns. The supply of their other food source, fish, could decline as freshwater lakes disappear. While the world's governments discuss ways to tackle climate change, the Nanets wonder how they can sustain their traditional way of life in a rapidly changing climate.